Hey, this is Blind Fox and welcome at my Russian review. Today we are going to do another American Russian available in South Africa and it, it's again a Sepako. Please go and support me on Patreon.com, please subscribe to my channel and please go if you want to go and buy me some vouchers at emerymountain.com I want to do rations from there sometime but let's get started with this I got this ration again from Tactical Distributors SA I'll put the link there on the bottom I couldn't find any packing date on the outside this is again a nice strong package with a peelable seal let's see if I can peel the seal I'm not very good at these and I did it I opened it oh, this one unlike the other one is in a separate little bag this is how the bag looks I don't know if that tells you something I see this is a black bag the other one was bluish the previous one we did I don't know if this that makes a difference the only sad thing about these bags is they don't have a resealable seal so you can't reuse this bag for anything else so let's get to the contents you can see there's, a, there's a, another bag that sits in we've got a trans fat free pound cake We've got a Mexican style chicken stew. It was packaged 2017, the 108th day. And again, this is a mini pebble. It's an magni uh, electronic magnifier. Here is the sheet. You can see this is 227 grams or 8 ounces meal. All the ingredients and stuff is on this little sheaf. We've got some crackers. Also packaged in 2017. This one, let's see if it's got a code somewhere. Can't see one. Wait, there it is. This is also a 2017 packed thing. To go with our Mexican style chicken, we've got black beans in a seasoned sauce, also 2017, there's its little sheet, it is 142 grams or, six, or 5 ounces. We've got grape jelly and a beverage powder grape, which is in this huge bag. And the bag is empty. Take what we've got in this accessory pouch, which is the same as in the previous one. We've got a MRE spoon, just leave it in there. We've got the serviette, brown one. We've got coffee creamer. We've got a wet wipe. We've got coffee instant type 3. This is a nice strong coffee. We've got salt and pepper and we've got sugar so this is what's in this 
Serpeco, Mexican chicken, Mexican chicken style stew meal. Let's get this stuff heated up and prepared. Okay, let's get this stuff out. They, these rations are the Serpeco um, rations without the um, flameless heater, the crackers again. I had these crackers in the previous ration. Right, open this. It's quite difficult for me to open it. And this time I didn't break the crackers. It's just some small crumbs. Again, these crackers are quite dry. I'm not going to mix my crackers in my stew, so I'm going to use the jam on all of them. Here's a bit of grape jam. And this grape jam is not extremely sweet. They, these, the, gra the jam almost smells like some of those grapes you get that you can lose, the, that you push out of the skins. That kind of smell. Put a nice healthy dollop on there. It really tastes like those grapes as well. Let's check out the pound cake. Trans fat free. Mmm, this smells nice and spicy. There's oxygen absorber. Ah, it's my first oxygen absorber. Mm. It smells cinnamony. Let's do the drinks next. This is that free coffee. It's interesting that it's in such a flimsy um, paper pouch. I would have thought that they would put it in a more a um, some a foil lined thing because this isn't even foil lined or doesn't look like it. This is a drink bag. These not those ones with the um, seal or the peel the peelable seal here. You're just supposed to use it and sort of hold it closed. This smells like. Artificial grape. Looks bluish. I'm gonna pop it into my bottle to mix. My bottle doesn't want to mix. There's the grape. I'll put it in a glass just now. Let's go and get the food. Dish up the food and then check out everything. Here the black beans contains 130 calories, from which 30 calories are fat. As I said, I'm going to cut the pouch open on the top. I'm not going to use the 10 notches on the side. Because I just want to pour this out into my cup. This savoury so um, black beans smells a lot like the savoury mince we get in the South African meals. Let's use the Serbia this time. I didn't use it last time. I'm just got some sauce on my fingers. See, here's the black beans. We'll try them out now. This is the Mexican style chicken stew. It has got 200 calories, uh, of which 70 is fat. I'm also just going to cut it open. This is the chicken stew. It smells a bit slightly cumin-y. I'm not savoury. Okay, there is the chicken stew. I poured it out. Mexican style chicken stew. No, I've got a clue what it is. I think I see corn. I don't know what else I see. Some cubes of chicken. I can't really taste if it's, it's, it tastes like pre-processed, but it could can also be just chicken breast pieces. 
It's got a nice sauce. It's nice and savoury. It doesn't have a predominant flavour. It might need some salt and pepper. I'll put some in now. This doesn't have a strong flavour. Definitely corn. Or bilis, as we used to call it. It's quite bland. You can't really taste the flavour in this. It does have a slight savouriness. Maybe oniony. I'll add some pepper and salt to it just now. Let's check out the black beans. It's very dark. Brown colour, the sauce. The beans. Much more flavour here. A bit salty. Beans are a bit salty. Um, cumin. This have a slight burn to it. Let's try a bit of both. The black beans. The black beans does enrich the, the stew. If you want to mix this, you can. It will make a nice mixture. It adds to the, the saltiness that the stew lacks. is in the black beans. And the bit more flavour of the black beans gets absorbed in the stew quite nicely. So let's just pop in the salt and pepper into the stew. You see the nice big chicken chunks here. Might have added a bit too much salt, but the salt and pepper does improve the flavour of the stew a bit. This definitely tastes to me like processed chicken. It's not bad. It's not dry at all. It's nice and saucy. Sometimes the South African, some of their chicken are a bit dry. But these American ones, this one especially, is nice and saucy. I, I do like them quite a lot. I'm amazed. I don't really like baked beans that much, but these black beans are quite... Because I, don't, I think they don't have a tomato base that much, they are quite nice. I squashed it, I broke out, opened a little bit of chicken, so it looks like processed chicken to me. Unlike other people, I have no problem eating processed chicken. I find breast meat sometimes a bit dry. And I mix the stew and the beans. As I said, the beans enhance the flavour of the stew. I like the slight afterburn the beans has got. You don't get any hot sauce with this meal. So if you like your chicken stew a bit spicy, you have to mix your beans in with the chicken stew if you got them with this meal. Let's taste these, this blue grape juice. Very much artificial grape. Artificial grape flavour, artificial grape smell. I don't know why they coloured it blue. I would have figured that a light purple would be a better grape colour, but it's very artificially. Let's taste this. This breaks easily if you want to break it. This is a relative light cracker. It breaks easily. It's a bit dry. The crepe jelly does help to keep it not so dry. Let's check out our pound cake. I didn't heat this up. It's nice and brown inside. Is a, sp a spiced pound cake or what? When is this one? This is a nice cinnamon sugar flavour. A bit dry, only slightly buttery. It is, it is, it's a nice, it's not too dry, but it's not very moist. Nice and crumbly. If you eat you have to eat this with either your, 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 your beverage drink or your coffee. It really goes nice with the coffee. I like this coffee, this type 3 one. It's a nice strong one. It's not as weak as the South African coffees. So what did I think about this ration? Besides the grape juice or the grape cool drink thing. This, I think the grape cool drink thing was my least favorite. I think the pound, the cake, 
together with this stew. Might have been my favourite. I also even like the baked beans, which I normally I hate baked beans. I would much rather eat anything else than baked beans, but they these are nice. And then in the grape jelly as well. So this is a nice ration. I found it quite nice. You only get a bit more than a cup of cool drink. I still have some left. So I'm going to enjoy the rest of this meal. Thanks for watching the... I think I'll put these... See how many of these got, I got with the meals that I still have left. And I'll scan them in. And put it on my Facebook page. If you want to read everything that's in here. Thanks for watching this review with me of the Mexican style chicken stew. I got this as I said from a South African supplier although it's an American company that was a packer is American. It, I got this from Tactical Distributors SA. I'll put the address down in the description. So please subscribe to my channel. Please go and support me on Patreon. And please, if you want to go and buy me some vouchers at Emory Mountain, my email address is in the About tab of my channel. So thanks again for watching. See you at my next review.